Welcome back everyone to another LEGO speed build. Today we'll be putting together the Porsche 919 Hybrid, released as part of the Speed Champions line of LEGO sets in 2018. The set contains 163 pieces and is based off the real life car that competed in the World Endurance Championship from 2014 to 2017. The set actually comes with a couple accessories outside of the original car, noticeably a start and stop light, along with a spanner and a small little laptop for our minifigure to use when he's not in the car. So just before we open the box, as you can see, I've already opened this prior to filming this, which also means once again that the stickers will already be applied and the parts will not be in their original cellophane bags. And uh, also, something I forgot to show off in the last video is that uh, each of these Speed Champion tips come with a couple more sets of rims containing these little air-vented plastic bags. Just opening up the manual here, we have some instructions on how to open the box, and a basic diagram of how to put the minifigure together. Again, not based on any real-life driver, but is sporting the official racing overalls of the team. So after that, let's put our minifigure up above our pile of parts here. And with a flip of the manual, we can now get to building the actual car. So now that the building is done, we can get a look at the actual finished car. It's pretty flat and it's pretty long compared to the Ford Fiesta that I've built previously on this channel. It's quite streamlined as you'd expect from a faithful reproduction of an original Le Mans racer. Stickers where they should be and creative liberties taken where necessary. Now to put the minifigure in the car. As with all these Speed Champion sets, you would take off the windshield piece, put your minifigure into a sitting position, just give him a little push just so he stays inside the cockpit, get the windshield piece, snap that back on, 
and then get this little like antenna bit, I don't know what you'd call it, and snap it in over the top of the windshield to keep it in place. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching.